Hi, welcome to Smooth Drive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today it's routine 13. And today we're going to be doing some mambo steps with a turn, then a travelling turn with a block, and then we're going to do one of our, well, one of our dips that we used to do all the time. Don't have a word for it, a name for it, but we'll, we'll show you what it's like. So. Okay. Format is yeah. demo, so we demo it first, then we do a, a relatively quick walkthrough for those that just want to do, uh, just learn it very quickly, and then a more detailed teach afterwards. So three stages. First stage is the demo, so here's the demo. Seven, eight, travel and return into Mambo Steps. And I'm not counting through this. Da, 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 turn and repeat. Definitely not counting through that. <laughs> then it was travelling the return with the block. Oh yeah, travelling. Oh, spin block. I totally forgot. Rubbish demo. <laughs> Catch right. Change grip and lean and up and finish. That was a rubbish demo, but never mind. You got that hang of it. I yes. think. We'll okay. get better. I promise. As we're going through. <laughs> okay. Whole move. Quick walk through is. Mambo steps, it starts with a travelling return, so we lead our partner away, turn our partners anti-clockwise. As we do, I'm putting the weight on my right foot as my partner steps back on her. I'm going to step left, and then I'm going to go right back. As I do. So I step in with the left foot, then we go step together, and then right. Forward on the left, ladies. Together, change weight, left. Back on the right. Together, change weight, right. And we keep doing these. We do four of these, like so. Then, as the feet are together, we raise the left hand, turn our partner, feet remain together. Then as our partner wants to step up on her right foot, we step with, and we repeat. And you can do as many of these as you like, like so. Then, feet together, turn out, lower. We're going to do a... Um, Wurlitzer, so we're going to prepare, spin block with the right hand, spin anti-clockwise, catch right to right, create space. Now we pull with the right hand, we change our hand hold into a thumb to thumb hold, like so, with both hands. As Nikki wants to step back on her right foot, we do the lean. Again, detailed teach is coming up, so don't just do, run into that move. Raise and away. Okay, detailed teach. Here we go. Like guys, left, ladies, right. We start off in the slot, lead our partner away. We step to the left on our left foot, create space on our right, and our partners are back on our right foot. So we do what we call a traveling return. But however, as Nikki goes to pass me to this part of the slot over here, I raise my left hand, my right hand goes to the shoulder, the nearest shoulder, I put my right foot into the slot, and then as Nikki wants to step back on the right foot and I go palm to palm with the left, I come round to face and we both step together as Nikki steps back. From here, feet together, change the weight of your foot, and then step back on your right And chest. forward on the left, ladies. And then feet together, Changing change the, the weight, weight, and step with the left. Back on the right. Feet together, change weight, back on the right. Forward on the left. And you can keep doing these. Now the normal, normal dance rule is uh, you do a, a set of four moves. So it's a, a pattern of four is a general rule. But again, you can do as many of these as you want. Now, again, the trick is with this move, keep the, the, the steps small and get the hips into the move. Da, 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 da. Okay, so it's a salsa move. What can I say? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Great for salsa and great for any other music, actually. So again, nice and relaxed. What you really want to avoid with this is a ballroom hold and do this. Okay, that looks absolutely horrible. Yep, yeah, okay, down here, <laughs> and da, da, da. Now, rule of thumb. You go back, sorry, partner goes back, feet together. As I go back, feet together, I know my partner's going to step back, so I can turn her now. I raise the left hand, turn Nikki in a 
clockwise direction. My feet stay stationary. Her feet come round together. And I know she wants to step back on the right foot. I so I can step. And we repeat. So just to show you the turn again. I can only do the turn after I've gone back. So feet together. Turn. Feet together. And step. So I'd really suggest just practicing this and the turn. So you get the hang of it. Here we go. And turn and here we go. It's a lovely move. Okay. To get out of it, same thing. As I've stepped back, I know we go feet together. Turn our partners lower and step back. Okay. Whole thing. I'm not counting the beats. <laughs> I'll work it out in the edit, I think. Oh, what the hell? I'll give it a go. <laughs> Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three, four, five, six, and turn, and one, two, I've lost count, three, <laughs> four, and turn, and away. Okay, I'm going to do that again. I reckon I can get it. I reckon I can get it. Here we go. Five. Six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, <laughs> nine, and ten, and eleven, and twelve, and thirteen. Okay. I, I want to know I got that right. Let's do it one more time. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two. Three and four and five and six and seven and eight, nine and ten and eleven and twelve and thirteen. First time ever I got the beat right. Okay, second move. We led our partner away with our uh, left hand, like so, at the end of that move. What we're going to do is create space on the right hand side. We Get ready for the spin. So Nikki's forward on. Right foot. Right foot. And I'm going to pull with the left hand to turn my partner clockwise. There's a surprise though. So I know my right hand is ready. Okay. So as she starts to come around, I take my right hand over and catch Nikki on the forearm like so to stop her spinning. Okay. So she wants to go clockwise. I've blocked. Now, I can either, the easy version of this, is to turn Nikki anti-clockwise like so and offer my right hand. However, the more challenging version, we lead our partner away, we prepare, we pull back with the left hand, turning our partner anti-clockwise, we forward on our right foot, so as we pull, we turn ourselves in a clockwise direction as Nikki goes anti-clockwise, we offer the right hand lower and away. From this side, lead away, step to the left, prepare, right hand's ready, pull, block, right foot is in the slot, we both turn, oh, offer right hand, don't offer left. I didn't see it. Offer the right hand. Okay, next move is a, a lean dip, so uh, it's actually a dip. So we pull with the right hand, raise the right hand, and we go into what we call a, a thumb grip. Okay, so you cross your thumbs over, a bit like a dove. Okay, and grab. Okay, so you need to have a very strong hold. Same with this one. You go thumb in and hold like so. Okay, I'm going to come over there. Like that. Okay. <laughs> Now, very important, Nikki's going to step back on her right foot. I have to be centre to Nikki as she steps back on the right foot. So I'm here, I'm not here, and I'm not over here, oh. okay? I'm literally right in the middle of Nikki's core, okay? From here, Nikki's going to look like she's going back and doing a lean. I am. But okay? you know what, ladies? Guess what? Ta-da! I'm taking my own weight, so I'm not flinging myself back into this dip, um, that's very unfair on your partner, obviously, if they're not prepared for it. So the best thing is for you to look like you're really going back, and that's just like a nice little 
Lean there. And I slide with your left foot. Okay. okay. To exit, you raise with the left. Take it over your partner's head, lower right. And then there's all sorts of moves you can do after this, you know. And out. Okay. So there's all sorts of stuff which we're not doing in this. So this move again, let's do it from this side. It's right to right. Your partner's back at the end of that move. So we pull with the right hand, taking it over our partner's head, and we go into this hold. Now, if you don't have this hold, you don't do the move. Take hold with the other hand, like so. Again, make sure your core is over your partner's core as your partner steps back. I'm not sure you can really see this, but there you go. There you go. You can lower, then you raise the left hand over your partner's head, and you're back into the slot. Okay, from this side again. Now, for the braver ones of you, okay, you can actually lean your partner further down. So you raise, take hands with a hold, both hands hold, go to here, then I can actually lower Nikki further down, like so, quite comfortably, up and away. Okay, now that takes practice, okay, and you have to literally be over your partner's core when you lower her down. And again, what you don't want to see, guys, is this. Don't lean down like that. You're going to end up with a bad back. Don't lean like this or this, okay? If you're not literally doing this, you're doing it wrong, okay? So it all comes from your core stays straight. You lower like so. Just to show you again. Away, change handhold. Again, make sure you're in the right position. And then I'm lowering down and up as much as I'm comfortable with. Mm -hmm. Okay, whole routine. Here Ooh. we go. Guys, left, ladies, right. Nice walk through the whole way through. Lead away. Raise the left hand. Come around for the Mambo steps. Step in with your partner. Feet together. Back on right. Feet together. Forward left. Back on right, get ready for the turn. Feet together, and then back into the Mambo steps, like so. I've stepped back so I know I can exit the move. Raise. What on earth comes next? Wurlitzer. Wurlitzer, I knew that. <laughs> we prepare our partner. With a surprise. Spin, block. Oh. We're gonna spin off a of right to right. Raise the right hand. Oh, smack your partner in the head as you do. <laughs> Grab both hands. Do a gentle one. Up and back. Okay, from this side. I've caught Nikki right across the top of the head with my forearm there. Okay, here we go. Lead away. Traveling return. Shoulder blade. Feet together. And one and two and three and four ready for the exit feet together and one and two and three and four exit turn whirl it's a great space prepare spin i'm not going to spin i'm going to offer my right hand raise the right hand correct hold checked up and exit Whole thing to account. No way I'm going to get this right. Okay, whole thing. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and ten, and eleven, and twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, give or take, okay? Good thing about dancing is it's not an exact science, so when we count the beats, it's a rough idea of how many steps it should take. Okay, from this side. Here we go. Five, six, Seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five.
five and six and seven and eight and nine and ten and eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty. What? We lost, we lost another beat. I know it was in the Mambo steps. Not that it matters. <laughs> It's not an exact science. That's the good thing about it. Okay, if you enjoyed that, please like, subscribe and share. And we'll see you for the next one. Cheers all.